Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, Dr. Hayes, a, a question for you. First of all, then I'll get into more substance. I, I'm wondering if you can guarantee that my uh, freshman son at Iowa State is in class this morning. <laughs> if you could check and get back to me on that. I, I personally am not able to verify it. But, but thank you. Um, um, excuse me, Mr. Chairman, for that. It was just something I had to get off my chest. Anyway, uh, could I um, – I mean, one of the um, – in my state, in Nebraska, obviously, where uh, we export a lot of corn, soybeans, and beef, the the, the criticism that, that there are many positives that we hear in Nebraska about the benefits of TPP, uh, and and quite frankly of NAFTA, uh, and the, our ability to export uh, additional grain products and and beef products uh, throughout uh, the, the NAFTA area. Um, to those who say, ask, say basically that the NAFTA really hasn't had a, been a benefit to our um, grain farmers and our beef producers in Nebraska, it, 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 and that TPP won't either. I realize it's a very, relatively general question, but what would be your response to that? I don't, I don't track the sugar market or the fruit and vegetable market, and I suspect that if I did, my answer will be different, but it's been unambiguously good for the kind of products we grow in the Corn Belt. And Mexico is a huge importer of uh, U.S. meat. Uh, probably 30 to 40 percent of the meat consumed down there is imported, and um, uh, that has skyrocketed since uh, NAFTA. Um, and even in, in eastern Canada, we actually export uh, quite a bit of meat, too. So. Um, I, I think we learn in, in, in our introductory uh, freshman courses that free trade is good, and, and uh, I tend to believe in that. And uh, NAFTA was a solid, well-structured free trade agreement. Right. And then and as we look forward to, to TPP from our area, from Nebraska, and, and, and I agree with you that NAFTA has been a significant benefit to our producers, um, how, how do you see that uh, TPP impacting what already has uh, evolved in, in NAFTA? Well, um, Japan has uh, import duties of 45% on beef and, f uh, depending on how you measure it, maybe 30 to 40% on pork. And they go uh, to 10% and, and then for beef, close to zero. Uh, the, um, the Japanese beef and pork industry simply cannot survive if if they're competing against U.S. product. And uh, it, as they reduce production and as their consumers eat more, uh, the U.S. is in a really good position to meet those markets. Uh, the, the other competing country is Europe, and it does not have the ability to ship chilled product into those countries. So uh, Japan is, is there, and then uh, Vietnam, Vietnam is a poor country, but they're eliminating all of their duties uh, on the on their products of relevance to the Midwest over about 10 years. And uh, it's 90 million hungry people who are entrepreneurial, and, and uh, in my sense, this agreement will make them wealthy. And uh, instead of developing their own uh, value-added livestock industries, a lot of that will, will be imported if these agreements are enforced as designed. All right. Thanks very much. And my last question from an economics perspective, um, and this is I'm sure difficult to speculate on necessarily, but on the price side, uh, the feedback, of course, the question we get is, you know, Brad, is this going to uh, help us on, our, on, a, on the price of our product? And uh, what's your general comment on that, uh, TPP now? Uh, I watch uh, the futures markets, uh, and uh, I, can, I can tell when we're going to have a good month for exports. Because, By the way, our export statistics are two months out of date, but the futures market is, is up to the minute because the people in those companies taking the orders or, or need, need to buy the product. And I can tell when we're exporting a lot because the futures market is and the cash markets are up. Uh, the, even though the U.S. is huge in terms of demand and supply, um, a small perturbation caused by a new export order can, can significantly influence price. Right. That's all I have. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I yield back.